Huh. People really seem to like that joke where I hit myself in the head with a keyboard. Okay, then. I think it's obvious what we gotta do next. If this is the only way to get to a million views, then so be it. Ow! Everybody and welcome back to another episode of I Coleman is Doomed. I'm I Coleman, and here's some Doom. Great! This is a show where I play through every single level of every single Doom game using only the two weakest weapons on the hardest difficulty. We're playing through Doom 3 and we're on a level called Communications. We've been having some trouble, but that's all about to go away because we are gonna activate Sentry. Oh wait, wait, no, no, hey, come back! I want all of these! Hey, wait! Activate again! Activate again! What button do I gotta press to activate again? Activate! Please! Okay, fine, fine, whatever. Let's go. What's fun about the sentry sections is that instead of playing the game, you can just take a nice nap or something. Maybe catch up on some reading. You read any good books lately? I'm currently reading through the uh, Hitchhiker's uh, Guide trilogy for like the fifth time. Lord only knows. Love those books. They're my absolute favorites. Hey, thanks for getting the doors too, Sentry. I don't have to do anything. All right, they spawned in some guys behind me, uh, presumably assuming that I would uh, have to take care of those myself and not just let the Sentry do it. However, they vastly underestimated how dedicated I am to not doing any work. And it continues. Looks like they're doing this trick again, but I'm not worried. I'm just gonna let the Sentry do absolutely everything. What? Hey, I actually got hit. It's a bad sentry. Very bad. You're fired. Yeah, take that. Uh-oh. And you're rehired. You know, this area is kind of beautiful. I mean, Doom 3 gets a bad rap for being all dark and bleak. But, uh, no, no, keep going. Uh, the colors here, you know, the red and the blue. Could kill a pistol guy, could you, sentry? Ah! Hey, no, don't attack me. Attack the sentry. He's clearly the threat. What are you doing? How'd you get here? What are you doing, my man? Help me out. Uh-oh. That isn't good. Okay, fine. I'll help. I'm not gonna use a pistol ammo. I can punch caca demons. Come on. Come on! Yeah, how about that? As my old manager used to say, teamwork makes the dream happen. Yeah, he really said that, even though it's clearly supposed to be teamwork makes a dream work. He also wasn't really good at managing, but we are good at killing cacodemons. My man, these environments are so nice for something you spend two seconds in. And look at those reflections that, uh, nope. This is not how it works. Sentry, you doing okay over here? Oh, uh, well, all right. Back to the old grindstone. Is, is it gonna... Are you gonna... Is it, okay. Satellite control. Me. Me. Kabisha since you saying camping in the area. Let's have for them. Get that transmission thing. Seriously, developers of Doom 3, did I really need to remind me about the stupid transmission every five seconds? Well, Mr. Carmack, we've uh, just finished the progression chart for the communications level. Uh, now every green line here represents a place where the player will get a full security armor, while every orange line represents a place where the player's imaginary boss will berate them for not doing a good enough job. So, uh, what do you think? Well, I don't know, I just think it's, it doesn't really sparkle, does it? There's, there's gotta be something, you know, something you can do here, make it a little more interesting. Well, uh, we do have this alternate version, but I don't know if you're really gonna- <gasps> It's perfect! Absolutely perfect! Here's my keys, Timmy! Go ahead and take my car! It's yours now! And... Hey! Achievements have been disabled! Man, I've got so many of these PDAs now. Maybe I should listen to one of the audio logs. Recent power grid changes have caused many non-critical systems to malfunction. The report explains that this is due to either intermittent power outages 
or lower than optimal voltage input. You know what? Maybe these are super boring and I should actually never listen to one ever again in my life. File a port with central nut giving a crap. Okay, satellite control. This is the room with the transmission. This is what we've been building up to for, man, from our perspective, like for weeks now. Anything. Anything could be behind this door. Just imagine how exciting and different and interesting it must be. And security armor. Security armor. Full security armor. Ooh, buttons and screens. Is this working? Manual what? uplink established. All right, we got some encrypted data in a car. Go ahead, decrypt it. You hear me? Back off from that console. Do not call for reinforcements. We don't know what the hell is going on here. Oh man, I'm faced with such a difficult moral choice. Do I transmit the distress call to Earth? Or do I cancel it? If I cancel it, it will annoy Sarge, who sucks. But if I transmit it, it will please Betruger, who as we all know, is a close personal friend. If I cancel it, Swan will be happy. But Swan just kinda looks like a toe. I'm gonna transmit. You have no idea what you just did. Well, yeah, fair enough. You might have endangered all of Earth. Hooray! Wait, no, that's bad. Of course, in fairness, it might be interesting to cancel as well. You did the right thing. Green, you have just violated a direct order. Send that transmission. Well, okay then. I guess not. Sorry, Sarg, I did my best. I guess I'll go this way. Green, this is your last chance to get What are you talking about? It didn't work. Jeez, get off my back, man. Did my best. I guess I'm supposed to go to maintenance? Because I can't think of where else I'd go. Hmm, maybe not. Maybe I shouldn't go to maintenance. Maybe it would be more fun to go somewhere else. All right, let's do this. Excuse me, I'm just uh, running. I'm just fleeing, one might say. Get right out of here. Uh, excuse me, sir. You appear to be killing me. I would prefer for you not to. Sorry, sir. I know you have a vested interest in shooting me, but I need to get out of here and also grab all this health and also, uh, punch this shotgunner, I guess. Uh, come on. Come on. Oh, these sections are no fun. Oh, I forgot to hit the lift. Come on. Come on. How long does the elevator take? Okay. I think I saw something that might help. There's a health here. Let's see if uh, that makes it possible to live a little longer. All right, that elevator is clearly going to take too long. So I guess we actually have to... I think I'm actually going to have to kill at least this zombie. Just do me a favor and die, man. This is a lot of work. I'm tired. Hey, I got him. And there goes the shotgunner. Get the health. Summon the imp. Maybe summon the imp and then get the health, I don't know. I think it's been a long time since I've just gone one-on-one -on -one with an imp. And I remember why now. It's because it sucks. And now... This... Continues. For... Some... Time... There we go. Uh... I don't know, garage, I guess? This is so confusing. You have any- uh, return to lobby and head to the monorail station. Where's the lobby? There's 90 health here, which is nice. This looks like where we came in from. I left 90 health in this room? Why didn't I remember that? Oh, well, then where am I supposed to go? There were monsters there. I assumed that was the right place. Maybe I need to go back to communications proper? Except, wasn't that just where I was? Yep, yep, this is clearly where I was. I remember that guy. Alright, realistically, how is this not the lobby? Oh, this door's open now. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry, <laughs> we gots to go! Okay, enough communications on to Monorail Skybridge. Man, Monorail Skybridge is a really cool name for a place that looks like, uh, this. I'll just take a step forward here and... Hi, Betruger. Okay, grab some oxygen. Again, the Cacodemon's outside. Would be really interested in hearing uh, why they make it so that the Cacodemons are like the only monster you ever see outside. Cycle the airlock, cycle the airlock. Ah, dirty gray and green and brown. Caution, yeah, not exactly a watchword here at the UAC. Uh-oh. Um, this, 
uh, I... Hold on, guys. This might be really bad. The only way I've found to successfully punch uh, pinkies to death is to jump up on something, and I don't see any such a thing here. It looks like uh, if I wait for him to get all the way to the back, I can actually run past him. Uh, maggots, zombies. Uh, is there a way out? How do we get the door open, for example? Ah, still nothing to jump on here. Door's not opening. Let me test the hypothesis. Okay, so once you kill all the monsters, the door opens. I have an idea. Probably a stupid one. All right, ah, uh, ow, ah, yikes. First we gotta lure him back here again. Now, what if we duck into the side here, which we can't because there's a zombie in the way. There's a little cubby hole that I think might be advantageous. Okay, let me in, okay. Come on, zombie, I need you to get out of the way and let me in to the little cubby hole where the pinky demon can't kill me, please! Well, okay. How many bullets does it take to kill you again? Wow. Seems like I had exactly enough. That just leaves the zombie. That just leaves the zombies and the maggot, and, well, heck, we know what to do here. And there you have it. And just gonna take all of this, all of it. In fact, if you have more than all of this, that would be great. Hmm. You know what? I don't trust anybody. All right, you know, I thought that was gonna be really tough. I thought I uh, might not be able to get out of there so easy, but uh, it actually wasn't too bad. Full health, almost full armor. You know, I'm beginning to think there's nothing Doom 3 can throw at me that I can't handle. Let's see what's in here. Well, that's definitely all the time we have for today, everybody. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy the